Welcome to Infigyan friends. Today in this video we will be solving one very interesting and challenging question from system of equations for the real values of x and y. So let's get started by considering our substitution straight away. I will consider 1 over cube root x equal to p and 1 over cube root y equal to q. Now we can take cubing both sides and write 1 over x. This will be equal to p cube and 1 over y. This will be equal to q cube. Now we will write our given equations in terms of p and q. So 1 over x plus 1 over y is 9. We will write p cube which is 1 over x plus q cube which is 1 over y equal to 9. This is our equation number 1. And we will write our second equation 1 over cube root x. So p plus 1 times 1 over cube root y. This is q. q plus 1 times 1 over cube root x plus 1 over cube root y. We will write p plus q equal to 18. This is our second equation. Now we will solve this new system of equations for real values of p and q. So I will use one algebraic identity a plus b plus c whole cube. This is equal to a cube plus b cube plus c cube plus 3 times a plus b times b plus c times c plus a. Now we are going to plug in a equal to p in this formula and p equal to q c equal to 1. Let's see what will come out. So we will get p plus q plus 1 in the LHS with power 3 equal to a cube so p cube plus b cube so q cube plus c cube so 1 cube plus 3 times a plus b p plus q b plus c q plus 1 c plus a 1 plus p or p plus 1 now from equation number 2 this is 18 from equation number 1 this is 9. So we can calculate p plus q plus 1 whole cube value will be 9 plus 1, 1 cube is 1 plus 3 times 18. We will write 10 plus 3 times 18, 54. 10 plus 54 is 64, which we can write 4 cube. So p plus q plus 1 whole cube is 4 cube. Now we will write here p plus q plus 1 whole cube equal to 4 cube. We are going to take cube root both sides. Now cube root and cube will be cancelled out from both the sides. We will get p plus q plus 1 this will be equal to 4 for real p and q. Now we can subtract 1 from both the sides. We will get p plus q value equal to 3. Let's say this is our equation number 3. From this equation I can write q value 3 minus p. Now I will use our equation 1. p cube plus q cube equal to 9. So here we are going to plug in the q value. And we can write equation p cube plus 3 minus p whole cube equal to 9. Now we will be using a minus b whole cube formula. 
सो वी विल राइट इक्वेशन पी क्यू प्लस थ्री माइनस पी होल क्यूब इक्वल टू नाइन लेट्स अप्लाई ए माइनस बी होल क्यूब वी विल गेट पी क्यू प्लस थ्री क्यूब इज ट्वेंटी सेवन माइनस पी क्यूब माइनस थ्री ए स्क्वायर सो माइनस ट्वेंटी सेवन पी प्लस थ्री ए बी स्क्वायर सो नाइन पी स्क्वायर इक्वल टू नाइन नाउ वी कैन कैंसिल प्लस पी क्यूब माइनस पी क्यूब वी विल गेट नाइन पी स्क्वायर माइनस ट्वेंटी सेवन पी प्लस ट्वेंटी सेवन इक्वल टू नाइन टेक ऑल द टर्म्स टू एल एच एस नाइन पी स्क्वायर माइनस ट्वेंटी सेवन पी 27 सेवन माइनस नाइन इज एटीन इक्वल टू जीरो वी कैन टेक नाइन कॉमन आउट सो इन ब्रैकेट पी स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री पी प्लस टू इक्वल टू जीरो सो वी विल गेट पी स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री पी प्लस टू इक्वल टू जीरो नाउ दिस इज वन क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेशन which we can factorize very very easily and we can write p minus 1 times p minus 2 equal to 0 now we can use product zero rule so either p minus 1 will be 0 or p minus 2 equal to 0 so from first equation p will be 1 from second equation p will be 2 let me write here p is equal to 1 and p is equal to 2 now we will use p plus q equal to 3 equation or q is equal to 3 minus p so i can write here 3 minus p equal to q so q will be equal to 3 minus p equal to 3 minus 1 comma 3 minus 2 so we'll be getting q value 2 and 1 let me write in the ordered pair p comma q this will be equal to 1 comma 2 or we will write 2 comma 1 now p was our substitution so i will write here p comma q this will be equal to 1 over cube root x comma 1 over cube root y this is equal to 1 comma 2 2 comma 1 now our target is to find x and y so we can write here 1 over x comma 1 over y by considering cubing both sides so 1 over x comma 1 over y will be 1 cube 2 cube 2 cube 1 cube so i can write here 1 over x comma 1 over y will be equal to 1 comma 8 and 8 comma 1 now we have to consider reciprocal only to get x comma y so i will write 1 over x comma 1 over y is equal to 1 comma 8 and 8 comma 1 so we will write order pair x y will be 1 over 1 comma 1 over 8 1 over 8 comma 1 over 1 so we can write our final answer x comma y this will be equal to 1 comma 1 over 8 1 over 8 comma 1 i hope friends you will like this video thank you so very much for watching do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video good luck take care bye bye